My fellow South Africans and global family, as we continue to go through this time that we're going through, this very difficult time, we continue to reflect and we continue to ponder, hopefully in a direction that enables us to grow, to get better, to become wiser. And one of the things that I have been pondering on is the amazing situation we currently have of how humankind has come together. And not just come together, but come together to become the best versions of who they are, to deliver the best versions of who they are. Whether this may be the first responders who are coming out to save lives, or those behind the scenes who are supporting us as we go through this journey. Those who are still working, the tellers, people working at the shops, those who are still driving public transportation to get people around, those that are still working at um, petrol, as petrol attendants. There's a whole variety of people who are behind the scenes who are continuing to support those that are at the front line. We can't not mention those who are really behind the scenes looking for the vaccine, trying to discover new ways in order to overcome this pandemic. So the best versions of people have shown up. We have artists, we have sporting personalities, we have celebrities who've come up to do amazing things with music, amazing things financially. Uh, I love the way that particularly artists who have collaborated and been able to produce music that gives us hope, that inspires us, that encourages us and keeps us going. Celebrities who have come out to give words of encouragement and advice and support. Everybody's playing a part and everybody's trying to show up to be the best version of who they can be. And this has made me think that the importance of when we raise our children, that we should enable them to become the best versions of who they can be, not just for themselves, but for the fact that in the end, that adds to humankind. They contribute to humankind. They support humankind in one form or another. So it is an exciting time to be able to look at our children and be able to say to them, be the best of who you can be. But it's also made me ponder on this issue that we're currently having, on the violence, the scourge of violence, both gender and children that's taking place at home. The fact that as men, some of us have taken this time not to add, to contribute, not to support, but to actually create more discomfort, more hate. And that's frightening. It's sad. It's highly disappointing that family members, women and children at home, have to choose between the scourge and the brutality of what they're experiencing in the house with the scourge and the brutality of this pandemic and this virus. So I turn my attention to men to ask you the question, what value are you adding? How are you showing up to be the best version? Are you extracting, taking away, making things more difficult, hurting others as they go through this very difficult time? And how can you add? How can you be positive? How can you encourage? How can you enable both the women and the children in your environment and in your home to become the best versions of who they can be so that sometime in the future, one day, they may be saving your life. Think about that. Thank you. <laughs>